Notorious Big once said, the sky is the limit. You can have what you want and you can be what you want. So how, how I did it in the last decade? Well, I graduated school at the end of 2008 and then I became a lifeguard instead of going to uni because I didn't want to go to uni. I wanted to do other things. So I got a lifeguard job and that was super fun. I didn't really want to do it um, towards the end because of specific things. And so I decided to try my passion with football. See if I could uh, take a run at AFL. I got into a, uh, in the waffle and managed to play an odd eight years. Now during all of that time, I needed to find another job. And unfortunately, the semi-professional life of a West Australian Football League player didn't pay the bills. So I thought, okay, I'll be a labourer. I'll try out window glazing. And I found it very interesting. I learnt a lot there. And however, it wasn't for me. I wasn't happy. It wasn't satisfying. It wasn't fulfilling. So I started training uh, to become a personal trainer. A year's worth of study, prac, and uh, logbook entries. <laughs> I managed to finally get my ticket. I found a job at the gym and I started doing that. I left the whole trade world behind, never looked back. Three years down the track, I wasn't really a fan of the gym that I was working at, in particular the owner. So I decided to start up my own business from home, all whilst um, playing footy. Then, at the same time, I thought, yeah, I reckon, I reckon I could give university a crack, but what could I do? Teaching is what my mum always did. My whole family was pretty much all of teachers. So I thought, okay, I'll give it a go. What's the worst that can happen? Fell in love with it. Absolutely loved it. Loved the prax, loved the interaction with kids, and was told that I had a knack for it by my lecturers. So then I uh, put the personal training aside. I retired from football, and because it was just not my thing anymore. I just didn't want to be a part of it anymore. I lost the passion. Yes, I didn't get into AFL. Yes, injuries came along, but the pursuit uh, and the drive to continue as an athlete um, stopped at about late 27, early 28 years of age. And then, um, yeah, started my teaching career and absolutely loved it. All whilst uh, enjoying my hobby of photography. Then the next thing happened. I started to take a little bit more interest in my photography. It started to distract me a little bit from my main occupation, which was teaching. So I decided to give that a break, and here I am, pursuing my um, dream of uh, creating visual art for myself, for people, for businesses, and all the rest for the world to see. And uh, the sky is still the limit. Who knows what I'll be doing next year. But I'm enjoying it, and I know that I can be anything I want to be if I put my mind to it. So, what are you going to be doing in the next week, month, year, decade? I've given you my example. I want to see you do yours. Hope you enjoyed that. Have a good one, and as always, good thanks.